Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we'll be working on the shop build. Uh, this is this 2016 Mustang that we built here at the shop. Uh, today we're gonna be swapping out the wheels. Uh, we used to have these 20 by 12 wheels that we have sitting over here on the car. Um, these are made by Ferrata. They are 20 by 12s all the way around, but unfortunately we were having issues with them and we ended up cracking three of them, replaced the three, then another one cracked. Um, as you can see here, we hit a pothole. One of these. So right here we hit a pothole. And uh, when we were coming back from a show in, L in the LA Convention Center, uh, we ended up getting stranded about half an hour, half an hour out from coming back home. And that sucks, so this car is always down because of wheel issues. Um, so we're kind of tired of having to deal with issues with the car not being able to be driven around because of the wheels or there's some kind of issue with the wheels and that cost us brand new tires that we had just put on the wheels. The tires now now has to go to the trash because it doesn't work anymore. It has a big old hole on the side and yeah so we just decided to not use these wheels anymore. We had a pretty aggressive uh, set of tires on there. We were running 315s on these 20 by 12 so they had a pretty good amount of stretch on them. The fitment was awesome and they looked really cool but we were sponsored by Ferrado wheels for this wheel set and you know we paid 1300 for another three and then another one just broke so we don't want to deal with that anymore so we are going to end up going with these three piece wheels. We used to have this on our other build that we had the white body on so we're going to be going with these three piece wheels. The fronts fit perfect 20 by 12s all the way around and the rears unfortunately were way too wide um, we had these on the other white body it's about one inch too thick for the car so we're gonna go ahead and reorder the outer barrels to get these redone and yeah while we are waiting for the rear barrels to come in for the aristos we're gonna go ahead and you roll on these rtrs we're gonna be going ahead and putting the car on these 19 inch we are going to have to be using 2 inch spacers with these just to get decent fitment on the car. But you know it should be a cool new phase of the car for a little while while we wait for the barrels. Maybe a couple weeks. Um, but yeah. So that's what we're going to be doing today. Is swapping out the wheels and tires on this car to the 19 inch RTRs. Uh, we did have an issue with the clearance on the big brake kit up front. But adding the 2 inch spacer is going to push the wheel out enough to give it that clearance. So it should be a perfect fit. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and start swapping out the wheels and take this car to its next phase for the next couple weeks. two inch spacers we're going to go ahead and be adding on all four corners we already put the two up front we're going to go ahead and add the two in the back and yeah put on the wheels and put the car down see how the fitment looks and go from there So guys, we went ahead and got the four spacers on the car. Uh, it's pretty much ready to mount the wheels on. These are the 19 inch wheels we're gonna be mounting. As some of you guys know, these were on Manny's wide body Mustang. It's the Grabber Blue that now has the green Ferrata FR3s. Uh, really sick wheel setup he has now, so make sure to go check out his car on Instagram at Manny.S550. Uh, but yeah, he's gonna be letting us borrow these wheels while we wait for our rear barrels to come in so we could rock these uh, three-piece wheels and yeah so it's gonna be definitely a new stage for the car uh, it's gonna be all blacked out so it's gonna be a cool look to you know change it up for a little while we did change all the decals on the car to a chrome so little touches we did to it we did the chrome front Toyo tires 
the Chrome Next Level banner and all the door decals for the tuner show in the LA Convention Center, which was like a month ago. The car's kind of been down since then. We've been trying to figure out what to do. Um, but yeah, got a solution to get the car back up and running for now. Get it back out there to the shows and yeah, show this car off. So, so yeah, let's get the wheels back on and get this car back on the ground. So we got the wheels on the car. It's ready to put the car down. The clearance on the front is pretty much perfect with a two inch spacer, it barely clears, um, pretty close. The big brake kit is massive for these 19 inch wheels, but looks pretty cool. And this is the rear. Uh, clear is pretty good. Uh, a little more space than in the front, but yeah. They clear, so we're good to go. We're gonna go ahead and put the car down and yeah, get the car going. Finally get it off of here because it's been sitting up on a lift for a while um, So yeah, can't wait to get this thing back on the road. Nessa's excited. She's not a big fan of the 19 inch wheels <laughs> She's it'll look nice for now though. It's nice for a little bit it'll look nice with the black ones. But Yeah, it's a good change um, It's a whole different look to the car. It's all murder out. So yeah, let's go ahead and put the car down and check out how it looks Check out the fitment because this car's been up on the lift for way too long. Where's the keys? So yeah, we pretty much uh, put the R big brake kit. We put the R seats in here, as you can see in there. The all the carbon fiber interior. Uh, yeah, this car's pretty much has carbon fiber all over it. Pretty damn good. I approve of the 19s. Not bad. Honestly, shit. Fitment ain't too bad. Are great. <laughs> we need 20s, but yeah. it looks good. I mean, it's just all black on black on black. That brakes pop a little more. Yeah. They have a similar design to the uh, stock performance pack wheels, a little more aggressive. Uh, the rear looks pretty damn good. The spokes are nice and separated so you can see pretty good through to the brakes and the rotors. So that's a pretty cool look. Check it out guys. We should do a complete uh, build review of this build, you know, tell you guys what's on it and all that stuff. Probably do that in the future. But yeah, for now we're going to go ahead and call it a day here. Um, Sorry, late. So, yeah, we just wanted to get this car back up and running, get the wheels back on so we can drive it around. It's been parked in the garage for too long, so yeah, I'm excited to have it back down on the ground. 
Comment, <laughs> like, and subscribe. <laughs> yeah, go and do that. <laughs> um, all right, we'll see you guys at the next one. Peace out. Keep moving forward. <laughs>